Hello everyone and welcome back to Kenshi. So today instead of showing some interesting view at the start I decided to notice some of, well I noticed something and decided to share it with you which is how the walls and roofs and you know all these surfaces how well the system of removing them works. The roof disappears if I look from from you know from the top. If I now move my camera here, this wall is also gonna disappear. If I change direction, this wall is back, this one isn't. And it's seamless. It feels so good. And yeah, if I look from, from the from the bottom as well, like the roof appears again. And if I would walk, walk, walk out or just move the um, the floors, we see everything again. Now we don't. Now we do. And these tiny little windows are also here. And they work from the inside, they don't from the outside, sadly. That's okay. You know, not everything can be loaded at the same time, although we can see through the door. Yeah, just, just a tiny little thing that really makes it so much better to, to look at. Anyway. We are back and we are of course finishing our research. Sato keeps on cooking and... Yeah, we're definitely running out of space. Uh, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab Milan here and give him a bunch of this meat. Alright, just drop it over here. What kind of weapon grades can we now produce? Tune number three. Um, okay, that we are still going for advanced weapons, I think. So maybe this will change something. Also, I wanted to rearrange this place a little bit. Although we do have the smithy here, and it will probably get an upgrade. Hmm. The backpack workbench, I don't think is really needed for us. Arrow bench is gonna get moved over here uh, so we can dismantle this we have a ton of, <laughs> a ton of iron plates here and what we're going to do instead is we're gonna go for well first of all the the arrow thing so it's gonna be in crafting probably um, crossbow and ammo Arrow bench one. We probably can't fit it here, can we? Nope, we cannot. Real shame. That's okay, we can definitely fit it over here. Maybe even this way. Oh, definitely. Okay, without any issues. And now we can also add. More copper storage, <laughs> because that's literally uh, why we're doing this this little change. We could even fit another storage here if we remove the one. We can fit one here and one here. Okay, so this is gonna add two. So we have two, four, five in total, and two, four iron. I am not sure if we remove this, if we could maybe, I don't know, let's leave it as this for now, I think it's fine. Um, I believe Slowline was to buy some food for herself. Alright, let's, let's sell the skin from Mark II, well I'm sorry, but that's the harsh reality, and let's just buy her a ton of food. 
75 for 9810 actually is pretty good. It's a pretty good deal. But fill her up with food and hopefully she will not starve for quite a while now. As I said, we're, we're saving her. Not sure why, but we are. Okay, so we're gonna have a lot more storage and hopefully this will allow us to, you know, um, mine more in case we miss a trip or two to sell all that stuff. Because these bad boys, well, the, the, now, now it's night, so it's not that great. Well, these guys have light, so... Yeah, either way, they are pretty, pretty fantastic at light boring at this point. Arriving at 80 and more. Okay, Soto is going to build a, all this. Advanced Weapon Smithing 2. So we can upgrade this now. That's exactly what we're gonna do. And we have a whole lot of iron plates just lying around here, so that's fantastic. Anyway, uh, Mr. Gorillo is currently fully healed. Uh, however, we are going to first heal Nadashi's leg because, well, it's not that important, but I believe it will lower our, our skills significantly. We are currently without the extension, the combat device. And yet we are at 40 attack, so we're getting to some really good stats here, which is nice. Nadashi, please, you're going to sleep. I'm gonna turn off his jobs just so he doesn't move move away from there for no reason. Since we're here, we can actually check the the Shinobi Trader. Oh, no, 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 not you, Mortez. You stay here. Um, let's see. Black leather armor. I'll take that. The rest... Not really needed. Was it? Let's take a look. If it's any good. Standard grade is 14, 19, and 65. 30% <clears throat> acid protection, 100% on stomach, 90% on chest, 70% on each arm. Okay. Melee defense bonus, perception bonus. So I believe it's kind of weak when it comes to defense. Actually, it's the same as the le Drifter leather jacket. However, it has less less cut efficiency. Also, less coverage aside from one arm, and less bonuses to be real. Now the gorilla woke up. Sato, you better leave. What are you doing, Sato? He is engineering, however, he is not actually engineering. How do you not have any building materials? There we go. Hey, this is more important. The gorilla seems actually pretty, pretty chill. Okay, but Nadashi is up, so we're gonna ruin this gorilla's day. Uh, however, we're going to grab a trash katana so it lasts a little longer. Hopefully. We're still encumbered, let's remember that. We still have the backpack that, that is... Wait, what? Oh, Plan still has, has those, okay. I'm gonna go trade with Plan then. 
Sato is trying to grab... Oh, these iron plates, seems like. Oh crap. I sent literally everyone around. <laughs> Uh, over there. Okay, Nadashi trade with plant. Mortez go back upstairs. And Sato... We're gonna chill. Milan, you can stay. Mike, of course. Sato! Don't get food. We're trying to grab this these stupid iron plates here. Oh my god, okay, well... Alright. Now I just gotta build the storage again. I had to do it because otherwise they would get stuck pretty much every single time. Yo, yeah, Nadashi, trade with plant, please. Okay, we're gonna grab the trashiest possible katana here. We're also gonna grab this Nadachi and put it back in the chest. So let's go and do that. Sato, please. There we go. Okay, we're gonna put these in here. Actually, put everything in here. Gonna move these down, and yeah, time to fight. So this is gonna be a, actually a pretty rough fight, to be completely honest. Let's pick him up, put him down, and fight. Oh what? Oh right. That's normal, nothing to worry about. <laughs> it's just gonna be unconscious for a while. I just gotta wait. There you are. Okay, so of course we're gonna get beaten up quite a bit. Thankfully we have really good armor, so... We should survive quite a long time still. Everyone around us doesn't care, which is fantastic. They're just doing their jobs. Which is exactly what I want them to do. So Nadashi's arm is actually getting kind of rough. Also, the gorilla escaped somehow. And Nadashi is losing this fight a little bit. Which is okay. Even if the gorilla escapes, I don't think I want to keep it here anymore. Like it, it's not that big of a deal. We are, however, gaining quite a bit of experience. Which is the whole point. We're gonna fall. We got Weaponsmith 3 though. We can make MK2 blades. That is quite nice, not quite fantastic though. Okay, Nadashi, heal yourself. Okay, Mortez is gonna do it for you. Seems like the gorilla is gonna attack the guards. Which is fine by me as long as I can get some fighting as well. We're not really blocking a whole lot. However, our melee defense actually gets better as we get hit. Alright, let's first aid the gorilla. I think we still want it around. Like, this training is pretty good, no matter what you want. What you think? K 
Okay, Mortez, I would like you to grab these. And Sato, I would like you to grab these. You actually don't have space. Uh, I can grab one more. I can grab one more. I don't think I can grab one more. Alright, one is gonna stay then. Okay, let's pick up the gorilla, put it in bed again. And we're good. Okay, so. Now we are going to grab our best gear. Okay, I think that's... We're gonna grab some better meds as well. Alright, then we're gonna grab iron, I think. Just a lot of iron. And with 80%, over 80% encumbrance, we're moving towards Akron's shield. Uh, we're gonna go to Shabatai and get the contract. Actually, I think I forgot the contract itself. Captain Russ, there we go. I think it's gonna be nice to have it. Also, we could grab some food, mostly as a means to free up some space as well as make ourse ourselves even more encumbered than we were. And yeah, we're going this way because we're going a little bit around, not much. And yeah. So, Nadashi is a little hurt, which is alright, we shouldn't meet anything too scary on the way, hopefully at least, um, and yeah, that's that's him. Meanwhile, I'm starting to think that maybe Lionhead should go around and... and look for some ancient science books. There is an overgrown dome. I'm not sure if I checked it or not, but I will now. Lionhead not the best with carrying stuff, however, should be okay. Should be okay enough. So we are moving this way eventually. I forgot to set up my chat, excuse me. Let's hope nothing happens while I'm alt tabbed. Okay, that's better. Alright, seems fine. Oh god! No, it doesn't. What happened? Something hit Lionhead. I would guess it was this spider. I have no idea. Do we have a repair kit on him? I think so. No, we don't. We have a generator core, however. That is not something I wanted to grab. Uh, with me. Oh, there it is. There is the dude. Running at 14. Okay, so we want to dodge the bastard. And quickly go back to Shark. For two reasons. Let's not stop Lionhead, shall we? For two reasons. First of all, to grab some kind of a repair kit, hopefully. And second of all, to leave that generator car with double, probably, because there is nobody else here. No real, no really good place to leave it, so. There you go, grab this. Why do we have some meds? I do not know that. Either way, now we are going to check out the big shop. 
for this shop? I don't know, one of those. This one is called big, even though it's not really that big, but it has like mechanical sign on it, so... I'm guessing there could be this, and there is. Fantastic. So we're gonna get some quick repairs done. And we're going to the dome again. Or we're trying to. We're not really succeeding. Okay, well I guess we're gonna have to navigate ourselves. So I gotta move this way, where I'm looking at right now. That's what we're gonna try and do. With try being a good word to describe our actions. Especially that it seems... What? Where are you going, Lionhead? Especially that it seems like there's a, a lot of water between us and our goal. So we're gonna have to move a little bit around. There's ruins somewhere. I don't see them, but we have discovered them, so that's nice. Uh, they're actually right on our left somewhere. Also discovered Hammerhead. Of course, one of these many villages in the swamps. So there are two types of things I'm expecting. Uh, in in these ruins and stuff, which are first of all spiders, or second of all some kind of gangs and stuff, bands, gangs and yeah. Okay, where are the ruins? Am I blind? Oh, there they are. Okay, since the game pauses itself for us, we can take a quick look. Uh, we're not going to be able to get in easily, however, it would seem as if nobody's really here. Which is good. Although these spiders are pretty hard to see at times, so I'm gonna... Use the fact that we're loading in, although I'm pretty sure it's loaded and just bugged. So I'm gonna jump to the dash here real quick and back to Lionhead. There we go, see? Or not, maybe I was wrong. We're gonna go here, 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 and here. Looks good. We have of course the option of going in literally anywhere else if we discover more ruins. For some reason... Seems like... Oh my goodness, Nadashi is so slow. It seems like it doesn't want to load this area. Okay, it seems like now it's fine. Look at these. How deep underground they have to be. What happened? Where are you going, Lionhead? Can you not swim? Yeah, this area really doesn't like us, it seems like. Okay, I'm just gonna... Let the game move Lionhead where he needs to be, and hopefully... Wait, where are the... There it is. Alright. Okay. He is where he needs to be. 
So we cannot pick the lock, we cannot use any tools, so we're just gonna smash the, smash the door. It will take a while. Why is the game pausing? Like, there's literally nothing going on. There we go. So it's gonna take quite a while, but eventually we're gonna get in. Hopefully we will not be harassed by any spiders or gangs while we're doing it. It's actually going decently. I thought it's gonna take a longer time, but you know. It's pretty cool when you have a time machine and you can speed up time three times. Speed up time three times. Three times. What? <laughs> I just realized that it, I mean it does make sense, but it's kinda weird nonetheless. Either way, the door will give in eventually. If you don't know how to do something, just do it with brute force. That's what uh, I don't know, that that's like an option, you know? Why not? Well, because it can result in someone getting hurt or something getting destroyed for no reason. But why not? Okay, so let's take a peek. Oh! It would seem this is one of these libraries. And these libraries are generally very, very peaceful, so... We are actually... I'm actually very happy. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna grab as much stuff as we possibly can, of course. However, I do realize... Oh, true. Okay, we need to buy some tools, I think. I'm not sure if I should go... Yeah, I should go back to Shark and buy tools. Hopefully they w someone will sell tools, because I'm honestly not sure. I could have also checked in that library. Sometimes they do have some, some kind of tools lying around. But, well... We are already pretty much there, so... Alright, so double. You should probably move closer here. And lion head to the big shop. Oh, it's closed. Right. Um. Well, we're gonna wait, I guess. Trade with double and give him all the books. It's gonna take a while until the shops will open. Maybe in the smithy. Kinda sounds like it would... Actually, maybe they would use tools, not really... Oh, hello. Ah, it's just a bunch of paladins fighting a bunch of other stuff. Animals, whatever. By the way, Nadashi is doing fantastic, so we're just gonna make sure he's heading in the right direction and just leave him be. Meanwhile, Mortez, how are you doing, man? My dude. My dude is crafting specialist gear. Oh, there's occasional high grade, seems like. Should be occasional masterwork as well. Oh, but there, there, there it is. Yeah, so we have mostly specialists with a bunch of masterwork here and, here and there, so... Eventually we will be able to craft some really good stuff. However, I cannot seem to figure out the smithy stuff. And the clothing bench here, I kind of forgot about that. We can probably remove it and put another storage here. <laughs> or here, rather. Uh, we will see, anyway. Seems like the day has come. 
It would seem like the shops are now open. I'm starting with this one because it seems like a general shop with, you know, a little bit of everything. Um, tools. I see a saw, but no tools. That's a real shame. Okay. Um, let's try the next one. Tools? No? No? Okay. Tons of books, however. Which are kind of useless to me. I have so many already. Yeah, I said the smithy could have tools, but I genuinely don't think it will. <laughs> To be completely honest with you. Yeah. Fish shop. Here's some kind of travel shop. Ha! Ha ha! There we go. Alright, we can now leave. And go back to the lost library outpost. Why would the library need all these... windmills? There were so many structures around, like, what exactly was the library? Why is it here? How old are these swamps? There's, there's so many questions. And literally no answers. You know, I'm gonna try something for the next episode, which is import the save and play around with some settings and see if it changes anything when it comes to the lag, you know? Because maybe it will. I don't know. Would be nice, for sure. Imagine going through the swamp alone and then you see someone running like, in this world, of course, like, not, not like in real swamp, like, that in, in the real swamp it would probably be Shrek fans or something like that. And yeah, in this world. Oh no, not again. Alright, we're gonna jump to Nadashi again. He's slowly healing, which is nice. He's jogging, holding his stomach a little bit, but in his full samurai armor. I'm trying to see how he can see through this, but I can't really, can't really tell. But we are less encumbered now, and we are approaching 55 strength. Of course, like we're not running with all this crap, with with no purpose. We are running out of food a little bit though, so that's gonna be have that we're gonna have to take care of it eventually. Ah, uh, Lion Head got kinda stuck here. He's not moving, he's just chilling. Look at this skull here, that's pretty cool. Wait. Does he have this thing all the time by him or is it Is it something that flies around here? Well, we're gonna have to wait to find out. It 
slightly annoying. Seems so stuck, like it doesn't seem like it. I'm not sure if it was. If, if, oh my god, no. I'm not sure if me moving the camera fixed it. Or if it just eventually decided that. Oh yeah, I loaded everything I want in there. I guess it was the second one. Because it's definitely not fixed itself. <sighs> Alright. We're going back to Nadashi then. And Lionhead. Well, he moved up a little. Maybe this will be fine now. Or not. Lionhead doesn't really want to move. Up oh, there we go. Lionhead, Lionhead, listen. Well, so yeah, it is part of his character. This little flying thing. Okay, use tools. How do you not have any tools? You literally have tools. There we go. Why is it paused? Wh what? Why? Why? Alright, so we're committing crime apparently. I'm genuinely not sure. I guess Second Empire, if it, they ever come back from the dead, they will definitely catch us. Committing this terrible, terrible crime of opening a chest. There's this tool. We can sit on it. We're definitely doing that. After we're done doing this, however. They tend to break pretty often and are usually discarded after use. I really hope that they won't break. Please. <laughs> oh. Skins is fighting someone or something. Seems like it's a someone. Seems like that there's more than one of that someone. So actually we're going the wrong way. Skins. There are a bunch of guards this way. If you can just get there before them. You should be able to... Alright. Can you patch yourself up? You don't have a medkit. Okay, we're gonna grab plant to help you. Plant? Okay, she's coming. Plant is coming. She has tons of meds. She should do it on her own. There we go. Good job, Plant. You can go back. Lionhead, he's, he's committing crime for since minus 40 something seconds. Okay, 
All the map, location already known, outpost type 1 and, and 2, all the treasure map, engineer's map, ancient military documents. Okay, we're grabbing all this. Um, we already know that, that's a shame. She's there, she's there, I can say, yeah, okay, so this is the same place, I remember that one. Uh, these ones are new. So we have one on an island. We have two more on the Leviathan coast. We definitely gotta go there. I think that's gonna be the next target after the Shobatai for Nadashi. Okay. Um, we can leave this and yeah, the tools are gone indeed. Uh, let's check upstairs. I believe there can be some things here. A small crate with another engineer's map. That's nice. Another crate, bunch of books. Another map or documents or whatever. We should probably we should probably do a run with the Ooh, wow, so many maps. This is actually very lucky. Okay, another stand. Any books that are in damage? Not really. I think that will be all. I'm not gonna grab all these old maps and parchments. Oh, I didn't check this one. Some leather. No, no thank you. Alright, so we're checking all three of those as well. And we have one in the swamps. That's nice. Uh, one in here in the Deadlands and one in Purple Sands. Berserker Country? Sounds cool. Dead Cat Plains. Alright, so... We got that. Where is Nadashi, by the way? Oh, seems like he has arrived, so we're gonna leave Lionhead here for a second. Uh, we should have... Eyes on Okran's shield soon. Should be right over here. We will know by the lag once it starts loading, and of course by the fact that it will appear in the in the distance, you know. So we're at 55 strength. There we go. Fifty-five isn't that great, and honestly, I shouldn't have grabbed the generator cars because what am I gonna really do with them? I'm probably going to have to sell them. So we have 66 carry weight, which is not bad at all. Yeah, we're definitely gonna have to go back to the hub before going out on the journey to grab, you know, different books and such. Okay, are there any bars here? Like, I need one to be completely honest. There it is. Tons of barracks, a boot shop, armory, bakery. Okay. What's over here? More barracks. General storage, alright. So, we're gonna sell this iron now. I think it's, it's time to actually... I sell this and buy something better instead, like food cubes, for example. 
And we're gonna sell these as well. It's a shame, but... That's what we have to do. You gotta do what you gotta do. Now we should probably find a lot of those. I oh, can't afford that. What about the boot shop? This boot shop has a surprising amount of non-boots for a boot shop. Oh, I don't know that location. Uh, we might grab a sleeping bag as well. Okay, what way station exactly does it show? This one. Okay, near Clown Steady. Maybe useful if we go to the grid once again, and we probably will because there is so much loot there just waiting for us that it's really, really nice. Alright, and now we're going straight to Shobatai. Meanwhile, Lionhead, you, my friend, are going to go to the ruined tower. Oh goodness, the pathing in the swamps is literally the worst. Okay, let's try that again. To ruined tower. Okay. So it's like he pick up. Oh, I haven't seen that. <laughs> oh well, um, seems like I didn't have to grab any tools after all. Okay, tools, power core, uh, skeleton repair kits. Books, uh, more tools. I want a lot of tools. I can't seem to grab these. I can grab these instead. Seems like these are closer. these tools, why not? Grab the repair kit. Grab the power car. Actually grab the book on the way as well. We have now this. <laughs> That's a lot of stuff. Alright, we're kind of encumbered now. Which is not ideal. However, we are still faster than, than the spiders, so we're going straight to the tower. Raj B no stopping. Can you like run at your actual speed please? There you go. Surprisingly there seems to, there seem to be no crazy loading or pathing issues on the way. For now. Of course, for now. Oh goodness, there is something going on and it's going on right at the tower, it seems like. Because this tower is occupied. Occupied by red sabers. Thrall of Swishos. What? 
That's a strong bad boy. It's actually quite a bit of those thralls. Tower of Madness. Oh, so the thralls are here, are living here. And the red sabers are the one attacking. I thought I thought it was the opposite. The thralls are kind of weird. Uh, either way, they seem quite a bit too strong for us, so we're going to the overgrown dome instead. I said we're going to the overgrown dome instead. Good to know, though. We can grab one of these robots, perhaps it will be a good sparring partner. Zoom. There we go, that's the speed I like. There's a lot of space here. Uh, let's just take a second to prospect, take a look around here. Let's move this. We have iron here. We have we don't have copper. Okay. This deep in the swamps, it would have to be really good. It's not, so... Oh yeah, we gotta... Tell Lionhead to keep moving. So he does keep moving indeed. Okay, so the overgrown dome is on our left. Trying to take a look because I think I've seen some light, and light usually means yeah. This is this is it, right? It has to be it. Uh, I don't see who exactly are you, black shifters. So let's move a little closer. It is risky, they do have harpoon turrets or something something similar. Um, so let's try and be very very careful about approaching this place. Where exactly do they have a gate? Oh, this, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. They have two harpoon turrets aimed straight at, straight at that place. Um, so we still don't really know what it is. Can we get in without being shot at? Since these turrets can actually absolutely demolish any character in seconds. Uh, we're gonna make use of our time machine. Let's just make sure the time machine is working. There we go. Oh. Okay, well, I got my answer. We're leaving. I mean, I'm leaving. Do you want to talk or fight? I think fight. Not talk, that's for sure. And you're also pretty strong. You're actually stronger than Lionhead. So, yeah, as I said, we're leaving. 
I understood nothing to see here. However, one day we may break in there, into that place. Either way, for now we're gonna leave Lionhead in Shark. And maybe once we have some time we're gonna check out these ruins over there. We'll see. First, Nadashi will fulfill his contract. And now I am confident that he will able he will be able to do it. All right. So you and Double are gonna kind of chill here for a while again. Have fun. Thankfully, you don't have to eat, so we don't. Wait, where are you going? You're going the wrong way. There we go. So it seems like at the end of the journey we may actually... We can see Stout over there. We gotta say the views... Sometimes... Or, oh wait, it's actually not Stout, it's... Either the Stonkamp or Shobatai. Because Stout is right here. That is pretty awesome. Who are you? Vagrants? I think Vagrants will be a nice challenge. Hey. You wanna fight? Ooh, he pushed me. Oh, wow. Oh. Well, you don't wanna fight, but your, your, your friends here do. So we're definitely taking this fight. We already got hit, but we're also hitting, and we're hitting hard. <laughs> and we're not getting hit that hard. We're actually kind of terrible at group fighting, it would seem like. But yeah, we got him. Nice. Hey, you! You wanna fight? Come at me. One of you pushed me. Do you know what that means? You have disrespected. A samurai. This is not something you just do. Without consequences. Okay, I think we need some, some of the training in group combat. We're actually one-shotting some of these guys. Fight me, cowards. One of them... Actually, no, he's not getting away anywhere. We will not let him get away. Every single witness will be here. actually blocked one. Nice. I can definitely appreciate skill. However, I do not appreciate pushing me away while walking. And also, you know, being a vagrant in general, I think it's kind of... Kind of... Where are you going? Wrong town, bro. Wrong town. Who are you? Hivers again. I don't really need anything. And who are you? More vagrants. Who's your leader? This guy. I'll take that. <laughs> Nadashi's confused. There we go. I'm curious if we get any increase in blocking and such. Oh yes, we do. It's kind of small, but... 
We actually got a whole bunch from all these hits, you know, coming in. Oof. We might actually lose this fight. Unless Nadashi is gonna start slashing three at a time. There we go, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh, this is so satisfying. And when he blocks five attacks as well. Oh, yes. Oh, did you see that move? The armor is working. Is doing his job. Like without this armor, we would be probably down already. However, we have managed to take down this whole group. Fantastic. Let's keep going. You know, sometimes you just have to use the skills that you worked so hard for. Oh, seems like a tech hunter. Oh, okay. He's pretty strong. I would challenge him to a du duel, but I'm pretty sure tech hunters are rather peaceful, so... We don't want him to take it the wrong way. Like, I, I have nothing against tech hunters. I'm actually kind of a tech hunter myself, in a way. We can actually, like, do stuff from here. What? Ranger shop. Oh, hello. Ah, these are guards. We don't not we don't want to fight the guards yet. We don't want to fight in general though. We have some of, the, of these rebel farmers. I don't really want to get into the politics of this of this place. So we're gonna just pass them. We have the stone camp, the infamous stone camp that... Oh, what? No. Who are you? Traders Guild, huh? I was thinking about attacking this guy for a second because he might have some good loot. Sato! Oh, interesting. It's, it's the twin brother of our Sato who decided to, be to become a tech hunter. Alright, since we are here to help people, I mean, not, not quite, like we are here to kill someone, but. In general, we are we want to help people. We're gonna attack this skim spider and kill it. So it cannot threaten any any animals like Mark. You know. There we go. Quick heal. Do we want this? Let's take it. As a as a proof that we have defeated one of them. We can defeat two more of them if we want to. That's what we are going to do indeed. Or we're gonna get smacked. That, that seems to be a real possibility and that's exactly what happened here. No worries, we will get up. And we will f keep fighting. We will not run away from a fight. Okay, that one is running away from a fight and we... Kinda need to take it easy. <laughs> I mean, it would take a while for us to actually go down, but... Yeah, it's better not to... Not to do too much. Okay, welcome! Hello there, mister. We have some trophies to sell. Mostly to show that we indeed have defeated multiple spiders, but also to kind of grab a little bit of money, you know. 
Why not? We don't really need it. Need all this. Anyway, before we get to... Before we start looking for a target, we need to heal up. Because this is going to be a dangerous one. Okay, so meanwhile... Uh, we can grab plant, for example. I feel like plant is smarter than Sato. Um, don't want to sound, you know, sexist or anything. But plant kind of showed that she has somewhat of a brain at least. Meanwhile, Sato kind of... Holy shoots, we have so much stuff. Oh, plant, come back here. Forgot to turn off her jobs. Okay, do you have a backpack? You do. You have mostly food in that backpack, so you should probably put it away. If possible. You can also equip this again. You can also put this over here. And you will grab... Some of that copper yourself. Not much, but you know. Mostly for training. Because why not? Like we're moving to Vane's Pass anyway. We may as well. So Nadashi, of course, will talk to Slowline and they will And he will realize that Mark II is dead. He will face Palm really, really hard, as hard as he can in his current equipment. And then just tell Slowline to just 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 sit here, just just I don't know, buy yourself food. We have money for days. Just buy yourself food, sit here for however long you want to and need to. Just please don't die. And Slowline is like, uh I'll try. <laughs> Honestly, if she dies, I I don't know. Like I, I'm gonna lose faith in this whole business of running around from Stone Camp to Shabatai and even just you know having this woman for us, whatever. By the way, I think Mortez could use a bunch more storage. Although he seems to be very confused already, to be completely honest. Okay, what I was going to do is storage, armor storage, let's maybe grab a nice shiny and a new one. Right, we're going to try to fit uh, this, this bad boy somewhat nicely here. Um, maybe one over here, not quite, huh? Here, 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 I don't think we can fit any more unless maybe... Doesn't seem like it doesn't flash green at any point. So we're gonna leave it at that. Hopefully it will allow us to you know, do this stuff for longer. Anyway, uh, let's also do a quick check on our supplies. So, fabrics. 
Oh, we can grab 19. Leather. We can grab a lot of leather. Animal skin, well, of course, not really necessary. Iron plates. We are pretty much full on iron plates. This is not necessary. Cotton is not really necessary. So we can grab 19 fabrics and like 40 leather. 19 fabrics, 40 leather. First we're gonna get selling. The inn is the easiest to do that here. And they're broke. Okay. Now the general shop. We're actually getting the whole place broke. Okay, so we can buy all this without, you know, fearing any storage issues. We're mostly buying this stuff so they can buy more of our <laughs> more of our stuff. Um, maybe the weapon shop as well. I, I'm pretty sure they have a bunch of money. Twenty-five thousand. Nice. Okay. So this will be the rest of our ores for now. Back to the hub. Return back your jobs because we're gonna have to wait through the night. But no worries, Nadashi is bite bite back in shape. So now we have to find Oh goodness, what is going on here? A sand ninja was committing a crime. Okay, so we are looking for Captain Russ. Captain Russ probably will be in one of the police stations or barracks. So we're gonna check the barracks first because it's the closest pretty much. Captain? Samurai Captain, it's not Captain Russ. Uh, there is a prisoner here. Skins, actually, he's dead. Skins? Huh? It's actually the secret brother of our skins. Same race, same everything. Okay, let's see. Samurai. Samurai Heavy. He's crippled. <laughs> sure, alright. Samurai, Samurai Heavy. Samurai Conscript. Conscript reporting. Okay, so not here. Show Batai Police. We're definitely checking here. I feel like this might be the place. This might just be the place. I wouldn't be very happy about it. Police chief. Actually, no. Seems like this is just samurai police here. They seem to have a prisoner. We are, of course, we are of course going to check who exactly that is. Because some prisoners are unique and some are some can be funny. Oh, here's the Sand Ninja. I was curious about their equipment. So I'm gonna go check that. A Ninja Blade? Actually, whoa! Whoa! High grade stuff? This actually sells for over a thousand. Can I grab it? Is that gonna be considered a crime? No. Fantastic. We can we just got ourselves one point six thousand for literally nothing. 
General shop. Let's sell that real quick. Joey's bar. Thieves. Barracks. Okay, we're gonna have to check these barracks for sure. First though, let's sell our new... new thing. Thing. Nice. Wait, these barracks? I checked these barracks already. Noble house. You think he's gonna be in the noble house? Maybe he's in the Joey's bar. Like the all the previous targets were in the bars. Maybe he's just chilling there. That is a possibility. Oops. New buyer, welcome. Yeah, you're probably very happy considering how empty this bar always is. Shop guard, shop guard. These guards are guarding nothing aside from these safes and other crap that nobody cares about. Huh, so I couldn't find that that officer, unless he's maybe guarding one of the gates. Nah. Is he in here? Nope. Huh. Let's check the barracks again. Like, this is the only place where he can be, really, right? see any other options. However, all I see is a corpse of a slave. This is just a captain. Hmm. Let's read that again. Guard Captain Ras of Shobatai is seen as a hero since he was posted at the city since he was posted at the city, the illegal flow of hashish uh, into the city has completely stopped. This has obviously affected the gang smuggling into blah blah blah. Expect heavy resistance. Not much here. Yeah, he's not in the barracks. Maybe he is guarding the gates. Wait, is there only one gate? There is only one gate here. Okay. Yeah, not here. We have some residential buildings. A lot of residential buildings. We have more buildings. It has to be the noble house, right? It has to be. Wait, Koteshi? Why can I talk to you? Are you... No, oh, okay, just a trader. Okay, sure. How is this place considered full... F considered fully lit? There we go. Now it's not. We're gonna get that lock. We're gonna open the door. I'm gonna just take a tiny little peek inside. So we have Empire Noble Guard, Empire Noble Guard, Noble Guard, Noble Guard, and Lord Nagata. No Captain Russ. Where the hell is Captain Russ? can actually get in here, like... Nothing... Oh! What? He can't see me. What? Okay, he suddenly can see me. What the frick? That was weird. Weird.
So he couldn't see me, but he could see me. Now he's running around. Or away, or... Yeah, he's running away. I could kill him. <laughs> Alright, we're no longer committing crime. We don't have the bounty now. Nobody saw that. So the only captain I actually have seen was in the barracks here. He has no name, however, and I cannot talk to him. This guy. Is he gonna go to sleep or something? I would love to... Huh. Apparently there's someone in this bed. Whatever. He's very strong. He is extremely strong. Is that him? I cannot select him anymore. Leaf is on the way. In the way, rather. It cannot be him. It has to be... Is he just patrolling somewhere? Like, what the hell is going on? Bunch of slavers, whatever... I checked the gate already. Escaped slave, a oh, wee. <laughs> Gate guard. Gate guard. Ooh. Nope. I didn't realize these guys also have their guards. These are just houses, right? Yeah. And this, these are the thieves. Okay, I have no idea where the guard, where, where Captain Russ can be. And the only captain I have found was the one over there. So it has to be him, right? Just summarize, gate guard, gate guard. Surprised I cannot talk to him, however. Let's wait for the day and see what he does. And also keep an eye on the... on this place, see who comes in. Etc. And if this is truly him... Then we're screwed, because we have no way of matching his skill. He seems to have a really good weapon though. Actually, maybe not that good. I think my weapons are actually better. This is so annoying, like, I have no idea if, it could, if it's him or not. Like, I'm guessing no. I have no way of checking that, however. Oh, he went to sleep. Okay, now I have a way of checking.
He has an MK2, so my, mine is better. He also has high grade stuff. He actually has a different shirt than me, even though he has samurai armor. I would like to check. Please, game. I would like to check. Thank you. Chain shirt. Meanwhile, I have chain mail. Chain shirt has less coverage, so it sucks. Okay, but it's not him. It's not him. We would find... Hashish on him, for sure. 100%. In the noble house, there was also nobody there. Like, nobody out of the ordinary, of course. Like, we have these guys. The Empire Noble Guards, and... There was the noble, but... He kinda left. I really want to check that safe. Nice. First try. What? There we go. Wow, that's fucking worthless. I checked the roof already, right? Ooh, string of cats. String of cats, string of cats. Coins as well. It's really not worth it though. <laughs> it's so not worth it. Oh crap. How did you see me? I have 100 cats bounty. Ah, oh, really? It will, it will expire in 3 hours, so I just have to run around for 3 hours until they forget about me. This guy is attacking me indeed. This guy is also attacking me, well, was. Maybe he will be in the police station. Oh, shit, no, don't fight them, you dumbass. Ah, uh, now we're gonna have a much bigger bounty, right? Oh my god, just leave. We're gonna be wanted for assault, right? 100%. Yeah, of course. And now we have 23 hours. Oh my god, one tiny misstep, and now we have to wait the whole freaking day and night. Oh, hello, Crimson Rogue. Are you here for the same reason as me? Because I have no idea where to find or find the target. All right, slow line. I guess is going to be our infiltrator. Guess she doesn't have the bounty, thankfully. There we go. Police chief, samurai police, police. Hello. Do you have any goods to sell? Not really. Oh, the sand ninja was... <laughs> uh, where's your shirt? Hmm? 
No, there is only unnamed police here. Where the hell is Captain Uras? Up until now it always made sense, however... It doesn't anymore. These look like slavers. Yeah, men hunters. I'm kind of looking for a fight right now, to be completely honest with you. I don't really want to fight with the outlaws. I mean, I don't really mind, however. I'm mostly looking for the vagrants, as they are the... You know, we can safely say that they are not really good people in general. <laughs> yeah, they are starving and shit, but like they are attacking people like, instead of you know, getting some kind of a copper industry, for example. You know, like, how does that sound? Like, what? We're okay. Now we are. Wanted by the faction, okay. Let's see if I messed something up. Guard Captain Ras of Shobatai. Guard Captain. It's seen as a hero since he was posted at the city. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This, uh, this has obviously affected, yeah. Guard captain. There's only one captain. We have a sergeant here. We have gate guards and empire noble guards and stuff. No guard captains though. What are these guys doing here? They're just kind of chilling. What are you doing? You still have shackles on you. Do you need help with that? Let me help you. But it's a crime. Cheers, mate. If this raises my bounty... Okay, it seems like it doesn't. No, okay, we're good. We're just doing a, you know, good deed, freeing people. I can also stealth KO them. <laughs> ah, screw that. Alright, if he decides to join me, I'm gonna disband him immediately. Just a bunch of samurais, alright. Who are you? A lone samurai that is following a leader that isn't here. You what? Are you gonna follow me like forever now? I don't mind. Just not gonna like care about you anymore. I should have probably used that time to go for another run to sell a bunch of copper, but honestly I just can't be arsed. Too much effort for too little payoff at this point, like if I'm gonna need money... I'm just gonna, I'm gonna do it, but right now I really don't have to. Maybe the people will, you know, will have a break. Sadly we can't seem to buy any other houses here, so these three are all we we can get.
See ya, mate. Good luck out there. Uh, whatever you want, I'm splitting. See ya, man. Good luck. Ooh, the Crimson Rogue is... Crimson Soldier? Oh no, he's just following, so I thought he's gonna attack someone. None of that here. Slave Hunter. Kinda wanna beat them up. Like, there's a slave right here. I mean, not really a slave, like... There is an ex-slave here. Bandits? Oh. Okay, they're fighting farmers, whatever, I'm just... Ah, oh, where is Captain Russ? Where is he? Like... Hmm. It has to be that one, it has to be. Still have 13 hours. There's nothing, no other buildings that could... Oh god. This guy's still fine somehow. Okay. Looking for any... Any other structures he could be in? No, it has to. It has to be that one. Like, it has to be that guy in this place. No other option. Oh, this guy's dying. <laughs> Let's help. This slow line is gonna heal someone in time. <laughs> Congratulations. You saved the men. Oh yeah, I was gonna just... Samurai Captain. I cannot possibly kill him. Especially that he's pretty slow. So we cannot guide him out of the town or anything like this. There's no way for me to stealth KO. Zero percent, yeah. Put Slowline back in the barn just so she doesn't trespass on accident anywhere. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna find a bunch of outlaws of some sort. the dude of his clothes or armor rather this way just 
zoop through here without being seen. This way he not only will be... You know... He won't have that much defense. Our receiver is at 22, it's pathetic. That's fine. Not only we will limit his defense... But also we will make him faster. Oh, he's not sleeping anymore. Because Leaf kicked him out from the of the bed. Oh shit. We still have the bounty, remember. <laughs> so I cannot possibly I mean I could oh wait, it's in a leaf. I didn't mean to do that. I'm just stealth KOing them over and over. Thankfully, nobody sees me anyway. So, they are cooperating with me, uh, getting my assassination up. So I can hopefully knock this guy out at some point. I mean, my... My assassination is going up extremely quickly. Like, the idea is... That... Eventually... We'll have some kind of a chance, and we can work with 1% chance, we cannot work with 0% chance. Oh god. Oh wait, what? Still 0%. I don't think we can train on people that are not sleeping the same way. I don't want to be seen. We are being seen, however, nobody reacts. This is getting weirder and weirder as time goes by. <laughs> we can also just, just real quick see what's here. Nothing really worth it. So I'm constantly committing crimes, however nobody seems to care. <laughs>
This is so weird. Stealth KO on this guy is still literally impossible. Like, I could try and fail and therefore get my assassination higher, I think. Let's try it. Not see. Okay, he can see me now. We got our assassination up by one level. <laughs> now we are. Now we're screwed when it comes to the bounty. You know, I think I'm gonna just stop carrying. I cannot attack him. There's no way. I can keep trying to knock him out though, until I finally... ...get my assassination high enough. However, I can't even get this guy, like, not even talking about... ...anybody stronger than that. How did he know I'm here is beyond me. <laughs> it seems like everybody knows now. <laughs> Alright, we're leaving this town for now. Is he running at 22 as well? Yeah, he is. Alright. You wanna fight? We're gonna fight. Just away from your walls, turrets, and whole police force, my dude. Or you're gonna just be a coward and run back. Oh no, you're not. Excuse me, Nadashi? Okay. The game is freaking out a little bit. Yo, listen. We're gonna fight, we're gonna fight. Oh, nice. Nice hit. Definitely winning this fight. I'm gonna speed this up a little bit because it's taking a while. There we go. Well done, Nadashi. Good fight. Good duel. So we're gonna make sure. That they are no longer. Okay, yeah, United Cities are kind of not very happy with us currently. Ah, I really do not know what to do. Like, we can keep training our assassination until we get it. Although, even the gate guards are... Mostly immune. I guess we can train on this person over and over again. <laughs> She's playing dead. Why? I just knocked you out. I didn't attack you full on. Anyway. I'm a 
Hello. Welcome back. So... We're at 47 and 35 percent. I am not going to regret this. You are going to regret this. First aid, please. Who are you? Another gate guard, huh? There's a lot of gate guards around, it seems like. We got hit, actually, it seems like. Excuse me, can you, like, heal yourself, please? Wait, no, we didn't get hit. It was not. Nice. Um... So yeah, we're gonna be training our assassination for now. And literally everyone around. Who are you? Just a gate guard. Just one of them. Just one of many. There's a lot of gate guards here. And they are smacking everyone around me that I could possibly train my skills on. This guy's gonna wake up, so... Yo, wake up. Get up, coward. He doesn't want to get up. That's okay. He's playing dead now for some reason. Oh wow! She actually noticed. Yo, listen, I don't want to fight you. But if you insist... This, this plan is so flawed, but this, there's no better plan at the moment. We have to kidnap him if we really want to do anything. Make sure to first aid her, like, she didn't do anything to us. Oh, I said first aid her, please. There we go, she's gonna be in a recovery coma. Oh, the dude escaped. Real shame. Alright, we're going out into the desert looking for groups of people that we can keep taking down one by one. Training our skills like these guys. Perfection. Literally perfection. Alright, quick sneak. They're so... we are so slow when sneaking. Two down, two, three. This one. This one didn't care, actually. Still doesn't care. Oh, there we go. This one also didn't care. I don't really care when I fail, which is nice. They know I they they know they can't vest me, you know. Simply. Oh, they are running now to attack. Okay, these guys are stronger, which is good because we need I oh, got hit. Kinda annoying. It's hard to, you know, stealth KO someone in the fight where there are blades everywhere. Oh my goodness. Alright, let's see 
is somewhere where there is less blades everywhere. Oh, you're fighting me. I can't believe this. Try me. Oh, now you're on the ground. Oh, what a shame. Okay, now let me keep practicing everywhere. Oh, I got him. <laughs> he finished the job before falling down. Empire Noble, noble Guard. Having really trash chances still, like... Absolute garbage. Can you like heal yourself? Thank you. Oh god, I don't know what's going on. Either way, I got him. It is a massacre indeed. Who are you, by the way? Just a drifter? Sure. <laughs> Let me train on you. Oop. I missed. There we go. So our assassination is going up rapidly because we're pretty much assassinating her, knocking out everything that walks. And that is, you know, possible to, to, to do it on because... Oh, what the frick? You're just straight up attacking me? Do you know how terrible of an idea this is? Well, now you know. Oh, in the head. There we go. No, 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 I need to chase them. We're here to train, not to kill. Oh, hello. May as well, you're slow, so. At least I can manage to chase you down here. Start with the lower chance. Wait, wait. Let's do this. This will be easier. I got it. Nice. This is such a stupid way of doing it, but <laughs> I'm too committed now. Like, there's no way I'm leaving this now. And we're already at 60, and I keep going up, up and above. And honestly, fuck the United Cities. I don't care about being their enemy. May as well. You know, and we have now 13% chance of knocking, the, knocking out someone like the samurai. Which is great, because that means... We can start getting, true, getting real practice here. So we are 60 and 38%, we're gonna fail that. And we're suddenly at 61 and 10%. We're just gonna leave. We don't want to kill them or anything like that. He's really pers persistent though, right? Like, we, we might actually want to take him down. He's not a challenge in a straight up fight. He's only a challenge to, t to knock, knock out. Oh. oh, where am I at? Oh my goodness, what happened? Wait, no, don't run. You're supposed to walk back, not run back. Okay, who, who do we got here? We have some starving dudes, whatever. Fantastic. This is a whole lot of slow moving targets, pretty much. Let's get the lower chances. First, if possible. Oh. 
I realize what's going on. Oh, no, never mind. Yes, no, I don't know. However, we are going to take them down now. Slave hunters, so even better. Screw you. Anyway, he doesn't care anymore. Okay, that's another assassination training. Oh, hello. Big boy. Heal. Quick stat check 63. We need stronger targets like Samurais. So, you know, it's actually perfect because it's night time. Let's run a little bit. It's gonna take forever otherwise. It's night time, so they actually cannot see us that well. Please tell me this is a Samurai patrol. It is. Ladies and gentlemen, we found our targets. We're actually at zero stealth because our armor is... Okay, time to take off some stuff, ladies and gentlemen. This should help us. No, still no. Oh god, the pants are actually the worst here. And the boots. There we go, now, now our stealth is actually really respectable. <laughs> we are almost completely naked. But, you know, still. Alright, so let's make sure they do not see us and just move along. Who are you? Just a samurai, okay. Just move somewhere, like, in one direction, please. 100%. Wow, they suck. So, <laughs> there are gonna be legends about the naked men knocking out whole patrols, one by one, till they are all down. <laughs> oh shit, you know this. We're out. Vroom. <laughs> We're running at 25 miles per hour, but this guy... This guy also runs at 25 miles miles per hour. We're gonna have to defeat him in a duel probably. Like one more friend is also still chasing. So we're gonna move away a little more. Okay, the friend gave up. All right. You know, quick, quick full plate armor, and we're fighting now. This guy is actually pretty strong. I am surprised. However, we got the first few hits, and now he should not be able to best us. Good training as well. We're doing great. Seems like another stomach hit and he's down for, well, not good, probably, because we're gonna first aid him, like, we're not a monster, we're not here to kill people, we're here to train as good, as well as we possibly can, so yeah, uh, let's make sure he doesn't have a weapon for next time. And quick first aid should set us straight. Oh, wait, wait. Always nice to see a friendly face. Oh, hello, Sohei, dude. Who are you? Yeah, Sohei, the warrior monks of what now? Why are you here on pilgrim pilgrimage? Inner peace. Why are you here? Okay, I gotta go. Cheers, mate. Okay, so it seems like the patrol sadly move, moved too far away for us to continue training. 
however, we still have the gate guards and other dudes. So let's take off our pants and other useless gear. Can I please move it here? Like. There we go. I would like to... There we go. Alright, quick sneak. And we're moving on. We actually have a decent chance of taking down the... the Super Empire Noble Guard. Not so much the gate dude. We didn't get it. <laughs> run, naked dude, run! <laughs> oh, this is just beautiful. Did we get hit in the leg? No, we didn't get hit at all, actually. It's a real shame we didn't get that. We're only at 65. This is going so slow, and we're actually running out of time as well. How did he spot me? Ah, oh, you're ridiculous. Okay, I think we're gonna give up for a second. Let's put some pants on at least. <laughs> and with this fantastic view uh, today, we're gonna end this episode. Okay, seems like he gave up, which is nice. But yeah, with Half Naked Nadashi, we're gonna end this episode here with nothing. This episode, absolutely nothing. This is actually ridiculous. This was a worthless episode, but holy shit. I don't know. No, actually, no but. It was just a worthless episode. But you know, we, we did something. We're getting our assassination skills up so we can finally, you know, get another quest from the Crimson Rogues. Uh, I'm not sure if we're gonna continue next time. I mean, I guess, I, I think I'm gonna just keep training and training and grinding this stupid assassination. Maybe off camera, because it's kinda boring, I'm pretty sure. Like, I don't think it's a good idea to just keep going. Uh... So yeah, and we're gonna import. Yeah, we're gonna do. I'm gonna do a bunch of stuff off camera because uh, hopefully it will improve everything. But for now, thanks everyone for joining me. Let's let's get the beautiful sunrise or something or, or some kind of a chase there. I don't know, whatever. Not for us. Oh, this is a nice shot though. I mean, if he had some better clothes. Maybe we can actually just, just do this. Uh, how about just the chainmail? How, would, how is it gonna look? Not not great. Not 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 terrible. Let's just do this. There we go. Can't really hide the, the cursor this time. Of course, we're make, we're taking a screenshot. Anyway, as I, as I said. For now, thanks everyone for joining me, and I hope to see you next time. See ya!